Hey guys, Drew the Shed here coming to you from my kitchen today. Um, not smoking a pipe today if you're wondering. I uh, woke up with a little bit of a cough and some um, chest congestion so decided it probably wouldn't be the best to smoke today uh, even though I haven't smoked for the past two days so um, definitely going to be in for a pipe tomorrow. But that's not why I'm making this video. I'm making this video because as a lot of you know I won uh, Pottsville Piper's uh, James's uh, 100 subscriber giveaway and that showed up in the mail today so we're gonna pop that bad boy open so I got the uh, rat cutlery rat 3 here I'm gonna use that to open this box which again the um, mail service was not the exact kindest to this box but uh, uh, just so you know as well uh, seeing as we are in my uh, apartment here, uh, we might have appearances from Walter the Cat. So let's see here. Packaging, packaging. Alright, so we got a note here uh, from James. James, you have like really nice uh, cards here. So it says, uh, Hey Drew, sorry it took a few days for me to send this out. Really like your videos and look forward to many more. James Pottsville Piper. So always the nice um, notes in this. So I got the, um, as he said, the three Esoterica blends. So the And So To Bed, Margate, which I actually found a tin of Margate at um, John B. Hayes Tobacco Nest in Winchester, Virginia. If any of you are in the Winchester, Virginia area, by the way, go check John B. Hayes out. Really awesome shop. Uh, and then last, the uh, Esoterica Pembroke. So I am looking forward to all three of those. And he also said that he would be uh, including uh, four blends. Yes, four blends from Wing and Roth's uh, Pipe Shop. Uh, he had believed that they were... Um, Blends um, that were special to that shop turns out is just stuff that he um, would rename. Um, the owner would rename. So, well, there's there's more than that. Let's see. Wait a minute. Ramsgate. I knew he was sending the Blackpool. Okay. Northwoods clone. Okay. I do like Northwoods. Mocha. And some GLP's Gaslight. Now, the only one out of those I've had is the, well, the Northwoods, but this is a clone, so it could be um, a little bit different, which isn't bad, uh, because Northwoods is a great blend. And if you have not tried it, uh, go to Boswell's. Um, on their website and you can order Northwoods. It's a very, very good English tobacco. Now, the last thing he said he was going to include in this, and I'm, I'm looking at this box now and I am, if it is what I think it is, I am in uh, kind of disbelief here. Um, he said he would be including a pipe. And let's see here. It is in a Moonshine Pipes pipe sock. Let's pull this bad boy out. Wow. Oh, goodness. Goodness, goodness, goodness. This is a little Moonshine Pipes Ants. And it's got a Cumberland stem on here. Wow. James, really? Really, man? This? I... Wow. Oh, man. James, thank you so much. Uh, if you have not gotten a chance to check out um, Possible Piper's channel, please give James a check out. He, uh, he is 
has an ex, uh, an astounding amount of knowledge on the pipe smoking hobby, and he has just he's he says he's kind of an asshole, but he really isn't. Um, he's just East Coast, and that's the best way I know how to describe it. Um, yeah, James is a a, a great guy. Um, I will link down in the well below. Uh, to his channel, I will also link to um, as I because I mentioned it, um, John B Hayes, uh, because I mentioned it in this video, and also um, Boswell's because one of these is a um, Northwoods clone. So um, if you get a chance, go check out James' channel. He's a wonderful guy. And until I see you again, be kind and good to each other.